Martin Perez, what a year last year. Incredible. You think about it. You talk, that's a late bloomer. Yes. The guy's been around 10 years. He's a 10-year vet in the 11th year, 196 innings. That, that's putting on the big boy pants right there. Not too many pitchers get to that level anymore. All right, so Perez, the lefty, will get what? Turner to start. And that's a hard shot into the gap and left. It's cut off by Garcia. Turner with all his speed to second, and he slides in there with a leadoff double. There's no substitute for that right there. He barrels the third pitch he sees at 107 miles per hour. But it is his speed, period. And he was thinking, too, out of the box. RBI opportunity for Kyle Schwarber, the designated hitter who led the National League in homers last year of 46. And swing and a miss. Good changeup at 83 got him and strikeout number one. Ball four to Castellanos, and he will drop the bat and take first base, and that brings up Alec Bohm. Gets the call, third strike. What a lift for Martin Perez. And that's the pitch he's going to need if he's going to be successful tonight. Marcus Semien leads off for the Rangers against Bailey Falter. Again, with Bailey, it certainly comes down to keeping the ball in the yard. And he hits one into left field past the third baseman, Sosa. And Marcus Semien off to a really good start here in 2023. And on Sunday Night Baseball. No go, and here's Semien to second. Good throw, and he is out. JT Realmuto got him. JT Realmuto. When he throws the second base, it's not that conventional over the top. Oh, Watch how quick the release is. So athletic, easy. Here's Adelis Garcia, the center fielder, another guy that had a career year last year. Swing and a miss. Bailey Falter, welcome to the game. After a single by Semyon and a caught stealing, and a single by Seeger, he strikes out low and he strikes out Adelis Garcia. Five, six, and seven for Texas against the lefty Bailey Falter. Yeah, Young hit that one hard. Over the wall, and the Rangers lead it one to nothing. Well, a lot of people in Texas know the power that Josh Young has had. Fastball right down the middle, and as a right-handed hitter, that's what you exactly should do. This guy, Martin Perez, has really settled in. And every pitch he throws is shooting for the corners. That's why he was struggling a little bit early, because he was missing just off, but he didn't panic. And really, for me, his changeup, that one right there, has been his best pitch so far tonight. It'll be Castellanos, Bohm, and Harrison coming inside again. And this one in the hole and past the shortstop, Seeger. And up 90 feet goes Castellanos, Bohm with a good hit. First and third, nobody out. 0 for 4, runners in scoring position has been a problem for Philadelphia early this season. This is on the ground. Young will go to second for one to first double play. Martin Perez gets the two outs, but in to score from third is Castellanos, and it's 1-1. Already thinking two and understanding who the runner is. Harrison not running like he did when he was a pirate. Ball hits dirt, you're supposed to attack. He did just that. Perfect feed to Simeon, and then on to low at first. Run scores, but you get two. Trey Turner will lead off here in the fifth. He's one for two on the night. Phillies one, Rangers one. Turner the other way, end of the bat. That's going to get down, and here's a dangerous base runner for the Phillies. This is the ultimate pressure when you can have Trey Turner on with no outs. So we're looking for his first hit. Hit well, right center, deep, going back. Garcia at the wall. He's there to make the catch. 408 feet away, and Turner back to first. Adolis Garcia kept going back and back, and people have talked about it. We've seen offense, but if you're going there, you got to hammer it. Great job by Garcia, knowing exactly where he's at. This is his ballpark. It sounded beautifully, but Adolis on it. Mitch fly down to left his first time up. 2-2. Two -two. Hit hard, and pass Turner off the bat. And in the hole for Mitch Garver. Garver has a couple of homers yesterday and a single here tonight. Here's Ezekiel Duran. Beaten into the ground over the head of Falter. Turner will have one play to first. Third base was unoccupied. Watch as he charges Sosa as well. Paying attention and following the throw. And Alec Baum was the third baseman. Looks up and is like, wait, you guys better get back there. With two down here, the fifth. And the top of the order, Marcus Simi in the batter. And that one is into right field. Good piece of hitting. Garver to third. He's coming in. Throw coming home. Boom cuts it off to second. And out at second base is Semyon, and he will not argue it. He was unable to avoid the tag, but an RBI. 
puts the Texas Rangers up by a score of two to one. Marcus Semien. Rangers have made some defensive moves in the outfield. Travis Jankowski to center field. Garcia has moved into right, and Grossman moves over to left. And this one to right, going back. Adolis Garcia and a basket catch just before the wall. That's a heck of a play. Oh, yeah, just, you just moved into right field. He just moved to right field. Bruce Bochy putting, pushing all the right buttons. He's putting first, on a clinic tonight. First on the mound, and then defensively, Jankowski goes to center. Adolis takes a peek at the wall. And that's one thing that he always says. You look at the ball, then the wall, ball again, and you make the play. Here's Will Smith. They gave him a one-year, one-and-a-half million-dollar deal. He said, I like old-school managers. He's reunited with Bochy. He pitched with them in 18 and 19 with the Giants. Beaten into the ground. Young's been great all night at third, and he throws across the diamond. One down. He's really set the tone. Set the tone with the home run and before that, and he continues to do it defensively. Beautiful thing for any organization. You got a number one draft pick that looks like the answer for a lot of years at third base. One down, Bryson Stott. In the air, shallow left coming in, and Seeger basket catch going out is there to make the play. Bobby Grossman was playing fairly deep. Seeger was the only option, and a nice play by Seeger. It was the only option. You are right, Ravi, and it's him or nobody over the shoulder. There you go, two down, and Hall also with some power in his back. Beaten into the ground, right at Young. It's been his game, and it's over. The Texas Rangers, what a start to the season. They sweep the defending National League champion Phillies. Bruce Bochy and company are 3-0. They win it 2-1.